Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Angela and this is my precious yarn. We're not in that room though, but I am going to show you a room that I'm absolutely embarrassed about, but there's no judgment in this, right? There's no judgment here. I have a second yarn room that I haven't really told many people about because I'm absolutely embarrassed about it. But we are going to clean it. Today's Sunday. I'm in my scrubby clothes. I'm going to clean this room. It's like, it's just a small room, but it's, it has some gorgeous yarns in it that I need to get to where I need to get it. So now remember, my husband has been on my butt about this room because he can't even get, he put a new window in here and then I just started throwing stuff in there. I cleaned the other room. I loved my, I love my other room. This room, this is bad, guys. This is really, really bad. He's like, I need to finish the trim on the window. And I'm like, oh, I'm busy. But it's time to get it done, guys. You're not. Just remember, guys, there's no judgment in this room, right? There's no judgment. Okay, I'm going to show you. Okay. Look, oh my gosh, guys. <laughs> so what I'll be doing, see, I have some nice, <laughs> some yarns all put together. Oh my gosh, you can't even see the floor. Oh my goodness, guys, like I'm, I got my Sophie's there. <laughs> so I have to clean this room. Oh my gosh. It's just a little room, but you know, we got to get our act straight. Look at all this. Who does this? I do this. So hopefully you will see a before and after. And I I have all these empty shelves that, you know, I had my um, yarn on for dyeing that I took and put in the other room. See, I have some pretty things, but I'm going to bag all this yarn up. All this yarn on the floor, I'm going to... Um, wind up this yarn. This is my bag of yarn that I, this one, is that I need to, I, that I make baskets out. I take that and I make my scrappy baskets out, which I need to make a tutorial on. But guys, there's no judgment, right? Look at this mess. Oh, and all these beautiful yarns. And then I have a bag down there full of yarn. I have to get it oh, all down there. Oh, guys. No judgment, right? But we're got... so I got this beautiful room, but I have to, f I have to fix it. I have to. It's driving my nut, me nuts. My husband wants to get the the oh, well, the chicken coops out there. <laughs> my husband wants to get the trim on the windows, so that's what I'm doing today, guys. Wish me luck, and hopefully I can show you an after picture that I have it done. It's going to take me a few days. Like, let's be honest, this is not, this is not for the faint of heart, guys. <laughs> Isn't it? Oh my gosh, I'm so embarrassed. But, this is no judgment channel, guys. Okay, guys, wish me luck. See you soon. Okay, guys, it's the next day, and I got all my scraps wounded. Made a big mess. I have to clean that. <laughs> And now oh. I have, okay, I'm, I'm a mess, guys. I'm just, I've been, it, today, all day today, this morning, well, wait, it's still morning, <laughs> but all day yesterday, I've been working on this room, and I'm going to show you some of it. It's still quite a mess. I still don't know what to do with half this stuff. It's a small room, and I'm blessed to have this extra room, but what am I going to do with it all? Okay, let me show you. Okay, so I still have, okay, this is where I do my tutorials, but I still have all this. Bella's in a mood. So, I have all this to be put back in. Now, I do have everything bagged up and put, you know, because I have all my scrubby stuff, my cottons. I have this tray that I have to bag up. Sorry about her. I have 
all this yarn some of these most of these are just one skeins or two skeins that you know I have my bags I have this is stuff I make baskets out of and more bags or oh, a special thing there and then more bags some cotton acrylic that's a layer guys I love it my Christmas yarn I finally got everything well don't have those bagged up but everything is bagged up I just I'm getting a cork board to put over here so I can put my cakes on it that I've schemed up or, or caked up and then I have all this that I have to put there I just don't know what to do with everything oh, my husband's excited because this weekend he can get in there and finish that trim so it's coming it's really coming it just takes time I've been working on it for all yesterday I didn't stop until oh I worked on it for a good 12 hours getting all this bagged up putting stuff in here moving stuff into the other room because you know I got think I got to put all this this is my cotton stuff that I do my summer yarns yeah it's coming so stay tuned for more hi everyone welcome to my channel my name is Angela and this is my precious sharonery the other room <laughs> oh she's heard me <laughs> So this is the room I've been working on. My husband got the, you know, he can't, I got this, he got this done. And these are my pegboards. I hope you can hear me. So these are my pegboards. I'm going to put my cakes on them, you know. So <laughs> these cakes that I winded up, I got these. So, oh Lord. I got them, these came from the hardware store. My husband built, I, I don't even know what to say. I just don't know what to say about her anymore. She's, oh, it's like she knows. So one second, let me deal with her. Okay, let's shut her up for a bit. So this room is just like the spare room for yarn and everything. It's not as neat as the actual yarnery, but it's just, uh, yeah, it's a lot of my cotton, my scrubby yarns, and I will show you the whole view once it's completely done. I, now you've seen, that was last week. We've been, I've been working on this for like a couple weeks. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. It's, it's like a couple of weeks um, of working ordering stuff in like my husband had to make these and then painted them and then we ordered these you get these from amazon yeah so all as you do like i'm gonna try and move you f closer because i have you on one of the shelves this room isn't very big but i think i'll have to scream at you over there Okay, let me see. Let me bring you down. I have another shelf over here. Oh, this might be a better. There. So this might be a better view and easier. So I know I can't put any like on one side. So we'll figure that out. But these little things, you just put a cheap... Now, I don't want any animals in here, but Chief seems to think that he can go anywhere he wants. Sweetheart, baby cakes, get out. Or he ignores me. Come on, Chief, out. Now, 99% of the yarn in here is, okay, 95, because these cakes aren't wrapped in plastic or anything. These are my... I call it like, you know, the leftovers. What are they called? <laughs> Some people only have little ones. I end up having, like, if I open a cake or something, I wind it up. That's my leftovers. I forget. You know what have come to me. So I want to put these things. I just put this up here to see if it would work. And it does. 
I think I can get them up higher. No, not that high. And uh, scrap yarn. <laughs> See, I knew it was going to come to me. Scrap yarn. And I make a lot, of, like I make my scrap baskets and, you know, stuff like that with my scrap yarn. So I wind it up and it's just easier because then you're not dealing with like the end of the cake and all that stuff. This doesn't seem like the mint green. <laughs> this seems like, oh gosh, doesn't matter. It's, it's gonna look, it looks fabulous. Looks fantastic guys. So, I am, I've stole this, well, she says I didn't steal it from her. She's, she got the idea from somebody else. And she, uh, she wants one. Well, I'm, she, uh, she'll, that's Nancy from, uh, she's got yarn too. I'm sure hers will be beautiful with gorgeous yarns on it. Okay. All these. Oh, you know, those little barrettes that people use, I just tuck mine in and it doesn't seem to be good enough. I'm going to have to invest in those little barrettes. This seems to work quite well. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh, that's a middle. That's okay. So I just thought I'd bring you in here to do this today. Today is Saturday, Easter weekend. And my husband had to work this morning. So I thought, perfect idea, perfect. I don't like to film when he's home. He makes a lot of noise. Darla knows what that means. <laughs> I'm talking about with that. Uh, Now, like I said, I think I'm going to have to invest in those barrettes because my tucking in doesn't seem to work. And th this is such a, I think this is amazing. I love this idea. Just throw them on there. Oh, that's the middle. Okay. And I hope that's all for them. Those are my bobbin yarns. I was, I did one blanket and I started another one and then I got too busy from, for a boggy blanket. Mm -hmm. And I sent out, forgot to send out that boggy blanket that I made anyway, so <laughs> it didn't matter. So this room, I am so happy with. Like I said, I don't, I won't be filming in here. I'm just doing it to get this done. So this will be like, where I'm gonna put my scrap yarn. See, I filled them up already. I hope I have enough room. My husband will kill me. <laughs> um, you know, where I keep my extra yarns and my bags. My bags are all in here. That's a good thing. And it's not laying all over the floor. I have extra carts that need to go in here. Yeah. It was a mess. Uh, I, I showed you, I didn't show you me cleaning it, but I had to take everything out and bring it back in. I bagged up all the yarn. So... It's not going to be, I think it's going to be okay. This, this thing here is what I hang up my hanks with, which I don't, when I was in um, Ontario. So I don't want to get rid of it because I'm sure I'll find a use for it. I, uh, 
also my summer bags listen the ideas have been going crazy i'm not gonna lie i think i've come down a rabbit hole that maybe <laughs> i want to make it so i'm i'm making most of this stuff for it i have some wonderful people doing my pattern which the pattern is like people like me with ADHD and dyslexic that can understand. I don't know how other, I know it's a different for everybody, but when I see a pattern and it, or anything, any writing, sometimes a book, if I go to read a book, which I, I was I used to love to read, but I'd have to be in a completely silence. I have to concentrate. If I just look at the stuff, it looks like shapes. It doesn't even look like, doesn't look like letters or anything. It's, it's, it's weird. And can't read le uh, shapes, can you? Now, one of these boards are bigger, but that's okay because we just bought one board and cut it and that's how we did it. Mm-hmm. I got a lot of these, so there'll be extra of these. Just eyeballing them, trying to get them where I want them. And then this will be it for this room. I'll just bring everything back in. Pretty much everything's on the shelves that needs to be on the shelves. I do need to bag my squares up for Chantel and I's project that we are doing we she made a whole bunch of squares and I made squares we're gonna need more because I just want to make a blanket out of it and it'll be like our blanket okay here's one's dropped I won't have enough mm -hmm. I won't have enough room but that's okay we will figure it out right Yep, definitely need those bricks. We'll figure it out. Figure it out. So what is so... Once this is done, I'll be so happy. You know, I just couldn't... <laughs> I was embarrassed by it. There's a glass door. So if anybody comes in, they'd see right in here. <laughs> see? A little mm -hmm. glass door. Oh, you can't see it. See, all that stuff has to come in. Little glass door. Mm -hmm. All that's a mess because <laughs> because I have everything sitting out there. You know, it is what it is, guys. Oh, I love this idea. But this is scraps from the last couple years. Yeah, like it's maybe even longer. And then I just, I added like three different, different balls to them because it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what size, doesn't matter what weight. It's for a for the scrap baskets, I just throw them together. And I will be doing a tutorial on it once I get everything done. There. That's the center. Tuck that back in. It's going to fit most of them, I think. These solid colors can't, I, I made something with it, but I didn't like the yarn, so I just, it was too rough. So, I'm making some of my baskets. Well, I almost had enough. I 
I didn't think there's two, four, six, eight, nine. Didn't fit nine. But that's looking pretty good. Uh, I'll turn it around. See, that's looking pretty good. I'll move back. Looks good. Let me show you the rest of the room. Oh, you can, let me turn around. Okay, I'll get in this corner. Now, mind you, there's still things I have to move around. <laughs> it's a small room. Okay, so the shelves are pretty much done. Oh, there's another one. So they're just bagged up. Some of these are just ones of, you know, just yarn. I'm saving that for Chantal and I's blanket. And then my cottons, my scrubbies, my, what are these called? Those big bags, rubber bags. I have more, but they're in the other room. I'm not bringing them in here. Some more cotton, some bags. Um, I got, had some more bags made. I uh, don't know why I have all the these bags, I don't need them all, but I have them. I bought this yarn, this this fabric in Ontario, and somebody made the bags for me. And then a little bit more yarn, Christmas yarn, and then I have a little shelf over here. So I have lots of room, lots of room for yarn to be fit in here. Like the, the sh I can move these bags around and put them in there like there's so much room I do have to get more stuff brought in here so there's another shelf there's a couple of carts those squares have to go in a bag I have to maybe figure out those cakes because well maybe I can fit another row in there we'll have to see Anyways, guys, I will show you the completely done room. Hopefully, I will be done it today. Oh, I can see my chickens like, listen, <laughs> we, we still have the plastic on everything because, you know, we're supposed to get snow again. I don't know. But once that plastic is gone, I can see my chickens. I will be having coffee with them again. I'm going to go, I deep, I deep, what do you call it? I don't know. So I have to go clean them all out, deep clean my uh, chicken coops. So I will be back soon, guys. And I'm going to try and turn, I'm going to turn everything right now. So the, the first two videos are just little videos, may not be turned. So yeah. Okay, guys, I'll see you soon. Bye. Okay, so I think I got it done. I'm going to turn you around and show you everything. I, it's it's okay. I mean, it's a small room and I'm lucky to have it, right? So, let's see what we got here. Okay, so I walk into my door and I have my cakes of wall, the wall cakes. Now, I had to put some, they're not even. And I don't know if that's going to bother me, but I got them all up there. That's all that matters, I think. And then underneath them, I've got a couple of carts, another little shelf. Um, another cart, which has to be cleaned out. <laughs> and then another shelf. I put my, some whips in there. This has my Sophie's and those have the squares. And then it's my yarn. And then I have my, another cart that hangs stuff. And then I have my bags. You've all seen this all. And, uh, yeah. So, and then I have nothing here now. So that's it. Um, at least I won't get in trouble <laughs> for having a mess in here anymore. So the window's all done. He can't complain about, the, I'm sure he'll find something else. But anyways, thank you. And, um, this, this video will be a little bit all over the place. So oh, I don't know if I can get this to sit here. Um, you're crooked. <laughs> it is what it is. <laughs> it is what it, I mean, look at me. Um, it's going to be, there's two videos that are short that I show you the, the big mess. And I mean, <laughs> what I took from my yarnery and just threw in here when I was cleaning my yarnery. And I do going to do a video on that, um, next week. I think I'll just get, just throw this out here today. 
Um, yeah. <laughs> That's what I did. I hope it's going to be fine, right? It's not, it's not as neat, as tidy as my yarnery, but it doesn't need to be. And I love this. I love this. And I'm lucky to have this. I mean, I know it's a little room, but I'm lucky to have it. It's, yeah. And I mean, I have a lot of room for more yarn. Just saying. <laughs> okay, guys, I hope you have a great weekend. Happy Easter to everybody who celebrates it. And uh, yeah, see you all soon. Bye, everyone.